Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. This is the day the Lord's made. We'll rejoice and be glad in it. Welcome. Welcome to Morning Glow. Welcome to another time in the presence of the Lord. Welcome to a beautiful morning. It's going to be a great day, powerful day, awesome day. A day the Lord will stretch his hand and walk mightily in somebody's life in the name of Jesus. Father, we worship you. Spirit of the living God, we welcome you. We make great your name, O God. We make great your name, O God. From the rising of the sun to the going down of it, the name of the Lord shall be great. Bless us today. By the outstretching of your hand, let it be blessed. Let it be powerful. Let it be awesome. Let somebody be healed. Let somebody be delivered. Let somebody be set free. Let your name be glorified. In Jesus' name, amen. Just before we even uh, welcome you one by one, I saw something I just needed to quickly pray. I saw somebody put on the screen some, some Ryan in, in ICU that is in intensive uh, care unit. Father, we pray, we pray for Ryan. We speak into the life of that Ryan. We declare decrease coming out of the bed of languishing. Father, show mercy, show mercy, show mercy, show mercy. Show mercy to Ryan, show mercy to Ryan, show mercy to Ryan. Let testimony come for Ryan, let testimony come for Ryan. In the name of Jesus, we give you glory, we give you praise, Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen. I'd like to welcome everybody to Morning Glow this morning. We trust the Lord, you will be blessed. You will be favored in this new season, this new time change for us in the UK. Uh, I pray that you will always go the extra mile for those of you who had to adjust back order. For some people it's an advantage, for some people it's extra sacrifice, but you will be blessed in the end. Get on the phone, invite somebody to join us. Invite someone to join us, invite someone to join us. Let them know we are together. Hey, praise the Lord. Morning glow blesses everybody, the high, the mighty, anywhere you are, whoever you are. Went to the all-night prayer of the Four Square Church to minister and with a former deputy governor of the Central Bank. Told me of him being on morning glow. So everywhere I go, I meet people who would tell me, oh, morning glow has blessed me. Why don't you get online and never assume that somebody will not want to connect? They need to talk to God every day. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. We welcome you from the four corners of the earth. Remember again, invite your friends. Agbo, Delta State, Nigeria. You're the first city I see this morning. May you be highly favored and blessed in Jesus' name. Praise God. Warwickshire, God bless you richly, Abakaliki, Nigeria. God bless you in Abakaliki, Nigeria. Been there before to minister. God bless you richly, in Jesus' name. Praise our Lord. Maseru in Lesotho, in the kingdom of Lesotho, the Lord bless you this morning. Arabosha, Yenere, Kaba, Lozombradish, Kayeta, Laraba, State, Nigeria. Be blessed, Nile Favor, this morning. Houston, Texas, the Lord bless you. Stanwell and Staines, blessings. Silanti, Michigan, blessings on you. Walton Cross, God bless you today. God lift you up. Praise the Lord. Yes, happy 40th, 4th anniversary for Morning Glow, 23rd of April of March. We thank four years of Morning Glow. Be blessed today, be blessed. Basingstoke in Hampshire, God bless you richly. Barking, blessings, uh, Stanwell and Staines, blessings, Maidstone in Kent, blessings, uh, Morgan Estates, Lagos, God bless you, Sacramento, California, may you be highly favored this morning, Port Harcourt, River State, Nigeria, blessings on you, South Carolina, the Lord bless you richly today. May you be highly favored. May you be lifted up. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. The blessings of the Lord rest on you. Stanwell and Staines. Blessings. Dagna Essex. Blessings. 
Ikoro uh, du Nigeria, where well, we had our crusade. God bless you. In the name of Jesus, praise the Lord. Yamaoka, Kekosha, bonjour. In Abidjan, Dieu vous bénisse. God bless you this morning. Serowe in Botswana, the Lord bless you in Serowe. May you be highly favored. Yeah, I asked the other day, I wanted to know which city is close to Serowe. I've been to about three places in, uh, in Botswana. Techima in Ghana, I've been there too. Crusade. God bless you. Hey, man, I've traveled, man. I've been around, been around, been around. I've seen places to God be the glory this morning. We speak blessings on your life today. We speak favors on your life today. In the mighty name of Jesus, may today be beautiful for you. In the name of Jesus, may today be awesome for you. Kayarido kapate to ta 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 la. Zama mako tumbre kaya tale boroso kete kaba. Jeneri rika tale bro bronze kia. Rika raboshe kaya tale de. We speak blessings on people today. Elizabeth from Jamaica, uh, Saint Elizabeth, Jamaica. Blessings this morning. Pets wedding, Kent. God bless you this morning. Uh, Saint Paul's Bristol. Blessings on you. Reading. Blessings. Bucharest, Romania. The Lord bless you richly. Ah, yeah, Bokotoya. Clapton in Hackney. May you be highly favored today. In the name of Jesus, Richmond, Texas. Blessings, 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 blessings on you today. Praise the Lord. Nabedosha. Rikabakaradite Kosoto. We speak blessings on you. If Instagram is struggling, please make sure you reconnect. Well, maybe it was my own platform alone, but it's uh, still on. Thank God. Okay, praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Uh, Bethlehem, Pennsylvania. God bless you this day. In the name of Jesus, may you be highly favored. I think I will be in Pennsylvania in July. I'm, I'll get the city. I'll, I'll announce it. Tulls Hill, Southwest London. Blessings on you. I'm in Pennsylvania, I think, in July. New York in October. Uh, blessings on you today, Undo Town, Nigeria. Blessings, 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 blessings. Rikosho yoda kaya da da da. Tele rosha yada. Kame kuzombradish. I like that statement. He is risen. I cannot go down. God bless you, Mark Channa. God bless you. Praise the Lord. Stratford Olympic Village in London. Blessings, 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 blessings. Miko tosha yi kaza. Zilero koto pa kaza ta ye kebo. Zambro kembenga bo tali jena maritelero. We speak blessings on you today. We declare it, we declare it, we declare it. We speak it today because we believe it shall come to pass. Why no shandaye kaba tele talada ta 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 Umbro yenere no kate ka ta 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 We like to welcome everyone who's joining us this morning. We trust the Lord that you will be blessed and highly favored. Uh, so many of you whom we may have not uh, mentioned the city you're in, but we celebrate you. We appreciate you. We thank God for you. And we speak the blessings of the Lord on your life today. We declare and decree that favor will never cease in your house. Rather, God will bless you. God will stretch his hand. God will prove himself as a mighty God in your life. God will show up for you in the mighty name of Jesus. Every time in the scripture, Ira Mosaya ta ta ta. Hey, Kaloro, Ribo Kandili Shaya, Hey, Bakaya Tiko Tota Tata. This morning, somebody on this platform, I want to prophesy into your life that whatever uh, battles you are seeing, you are going to have victory. 
I was in between, should we just praise the Lord for the end of one quarter and then just focus on. But let's just, we'll do combine this morning. Praise the Lord. Victory over battles. Thank God for, for victory in the first three months, for the blessings of the first three months, for the favors of the first three months, for the glories of the first three months but also to declare victory over anything the enemy is planning in the coming months. God will see you through. God will go with you. God will give you grace. God will give you blessings in the mighty name of Jesus, in the holy name of Jesus. The Bible does not say that we are precluded from the battles of life, but it is not supposed to be something you turn to a mantra I'm expecting battles I'm expecting battles no 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 you should every day expect the goodness of the Lord the blessing of the Lord the favor of the Lord however you gotta realize it I'm sure you've seen it every time you have been blessed if Satan does not react man reacts some people can't handle your blessing they just become vindictive in fact i had a story last week man it shook it rattled me it really rattled me a beautiful couple i know fantastic couple nice people great lovely people who are truly blessed in africa they have such abundance in, as young very young in their late 30s no husband late 30 you have mid 30 very wealthy they want to travel to Canada, and and uh, and 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 the sister of the ladies there, and uh, the husband of the lady said, "Oh, please, you can't go stay in hotel. We'll apply for you to come. We'll say where well, you are staying with us, and we will want you to because anytime we come home, you, I mean, you spoil us. These guys have like seven, eight cars in Africa, man. And when I'm saying eight cars." not talking cheap cars and these guys said no you, you whenever I come home you take me everywhere your car your driver I'm spoiled I'm blessed so he applies for them they give them five-year visa this year this guy because he has terrible anger against his wife who is the sister of one of them he calls Canadian immigration and say these guys are coming to come and stay and depend on the state. They are broke, busted people. They are cheap, poor. <laughs> Not only did Canadian embargo or embassy, well, as a Canadian uh, system, it, it, it will have to be high commission. If it's between among Commonwealth nations, it will have to be high commission. They cancel the visa and put a ban on this couple. And he was denying. He said, hey, I don't know who did it. He was their lawyer who did intricate detailed search that eventually found out that the guy who was the one blowing them where they are Spain was also the one biting them when they don't see. He called Canadian immigration. It is unbelievable. Unbelievable. Because he's angry with his wife. Because he's an abusive husband. Battles of life. You never know where you will find it. Even, <laughs> even when the wife, even when the wife got to be told by the attorney who did a forensic search that your husband is behind it. He's the one who called immigration. This is the proof. This is the proof. The wife pretending like she didn't know. Morning prayer and their own she say whoever is behind the cancellation of the visa of the people coming to us, let them die. You say, hey, Amen, no. Oh. I mean, some stories you hear it and you are pinching yourself. I don't know, maybe because when I was young, I suffered too much. I suffered too much. Whenever I had help, it was tiny, tiny helps, but I clinged to those helps. My heart breaks if I see a person who needs help. I just want to help. I just want to touch lives. How can you then be the one who will, with your own hand, on one hand, apply for visa for a people because they've been good to you. They blessed you more than imagination. You know that they have the wherewithal. And you go and destroy them. 
till they put a ban on them. Now, did they expect that big battle? No, battles do come. But guess what? They will overcome. So listen to me. The Bible says, Job 14, 1, man that is born of a woman is a few days and full of trouble. Doesn't mean he should be looking for trouble all the time. So if you don't expect it one place, it may come another place. So I want you to know this one truth. Uh, you need to know your enemy. A battle is lost or won depending on the completeness of the fact you have about your enemy. My mother used to say, once God exposes who your enemy is, he can't kill you anymore. After all, you know that he is likely to use poison. And so you can't, use the, you can't sit down in the covenant of eating. Hey, ladies and gentlemen, brothers and sisters, not scaring you at all, but lift your spiritual life to another level. Don't sit down in dinner with just anyone. When you sit down in dinner with people, uh, as far as God is concerned, you are in covenant with them. Make food, because food is one of the instruments of covenant. Qualify who you go out to lunch with, to dinner with. Qualify. If you know that you don't really quite understand the spiritual life of the person, maybe drink water or drink juice or something. Number one, if you are going to win in the battles of life, you must know your enemy. Victory over battles this morning. We've won victories in the first three months. We're going to have victories in this second, in this second quarter in the name of Jesus. Uh, if you have little information about your enemy, you are in deep trouble, brother. But when you have adequate information, you will win. One of the smartest things uh, Nehemiah did, one of the smartest things Nehemiah did was not to assume about Jerusalem before he went. Everyone who had gone back, you know, Jerusalem became empty because they were scattered in the, in, the, in, the, in the time they came to carry them to slavery. But some people began to return back, return back, return back, return back, return back. So when he became burdened to go and rebuild, what he did was to go and get information from those who were coming back to Babylon. How is the place? What is happening? Who are our friends? Who are our enemies? What are they doing? So even before he entered, he knew about Sambalat, he knew about Tobias, he knew about everyone there. He knew what they were doing before he showed up. He knew. Have adequate information, for we are not ignorant of Satan's devices. Without information, harder overcome. Don't go around sniffing on people, thinking that's the way to know your enemies. Pray a lot. Pray in the spirit. Above every other thing, as you grow in life, natural, spiritual, mental, ministry, uh, physical, business, pray for discernment. So if people are showing you their 32 teeth in smile, you know if it is a lie. If the same teeth is covered in blood. So have a knowledge of your enemies. Ephesians 6 verse 11 and 12. Having done all to stand. And then number two, have a strategy. This morning somebody is going to overcome. The enemy will not have the final say in your life. You will have the victory. A lack of strategy in the place of battle could be a sign of weakness or ill preparation. You notice the Bible says, by wisdom you will make war. Kaya. By wisdom you will make war. Hey. So if, for example, the career you have is a war itself in the city where you live, you do it by wisdom. You don't do it just by certificate. When you do it by wisdom, you win where others fail. The devices of the enemy is exposed to you. You have victory. And after you have deci deciphered your enemies, it is important for you to devise the, de the instrument with which to deal with him. So when the enemy comes like a flood, one of the things is that the Bible says, the spirit of the Lord, Maya ya, will raise a standard against him. And the Bible tells us also they overcame him by the blood of the lamb and the word of their testimony. Angels did not try anything else.
I have a, Father, we give you glory. We magnify your name this morning. We celebrate your goodness. Three months of victory. Three months of favor. Three months of the provisions of God. Three months of the goodness of God. Three months of the grace of God. Three months of the power of God. Three months of the blessings of the Lord. Ah, come and see the goodness of God. 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 Bialere mama chuku. Bialere mama chuku. Come and see the goodness of God. Lord, we bless you. We thank you for the victories, for the favors, for the, for the open doors, for the outstretching of your hand, for shaming the devil from January 1 to, to March 31st. For making us to be above only, never under. We bless you. 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 We thank you, O God. We celebrate your faithfulness. Your faithfulness is never ending. Battles that came, you won them for us. Lies of the enemy, you silenced them for us. When the enemy came like a flood, you, the Spirit of the Lord, you raised the standard against him. To you be glory. To you be praise. To you be honor. To you be adoration. We rejoice. We bless your name. We thank you, Lord. You will never fail. You have never failed. And you will never fail. Thank you, my Father. Thank you, my Savior. Maledo Shakaya. Pareke Toromba. Zalika Yidesha. In the name of Jesus. Ha! Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The enemy wants to stop you, but he will not be able to stop you. If the enemy wants to prevent you from blessing, but he will not be able to prevent you from your blessings. I speak into your life this morning because your blessings will manifest globally. Your, your blessings will manifest beyond imagination. And so in this, in this new quarter, I prophesy on somebody this morning that God will make everything you desire to manifest. You will have victory over battles that wants to prevent your manifestation. Every, every battle that wants to stop your manifestation, we stop it. That wants to prevent your manifestation, we stop it. Every hand of the enemy that say, no, 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 no. If I let this woman blow, then I will not be able to control her. We frustrate the hand of Satan. We frustrate the hand of the enemy. Whatever wants to debar you, we debar it. Whatever wants to forbid you from entering your blessing, we forbid it. Whatever wants to prohibit you to prevent it, to prohibit. We prohibit it from touching your life. Ah, Satan has no authority over you. Kaya For this habitation was fashioned for the Lord's presence. Whatever wants to disallow you, we disallow it in the name of Jesus. Wherever you are, let your amen be powerful. Whatever wants to frustrate you, we frustrate it in the name of Jesus. Whatever wants to foil your attempts to grow, to increase, to, be break, to break through, to have testimony, we foil its attempt in the name of Jesus. Whatever wants to thwart your breakthrough, thwart your testimony, we cancel it by the blood of the Lamb. Whatever wants to hamper you, stay in your way, block you from reaching where God is taking you. We cancel, we cancel, we cancel, we cancel, we cancel, we cancel, we cancel in the name of Jesus. Whatever wants to obstruct you from reaching the place of destiny, the place of purpose, the place of glory, we nullify in the name of Jesus. Whatever wants to shut you out of blessing. We shut it out. Whatever wants to put a stop to your blessing, we put a stop to it. In the name of Jesus. Uh, this morning we declare that what God have placed place in your life to manifest, you will manifest it. You will manifest global blessings. Somebody hearing me this morning in this new quarter, I speak into your life, Romans 8, 19, for the earnest expectation of, of the creation eagerly waits for the 
revealing of the sons of God. God will reveal your glory. God will reveal your favor. God will reveal your blessing. God will bring out your blessing. God will bring out, unveil you, unveil you. The entire universe is standing on tiptoe. There's a TPT translation. Yearning to see the unveiling of God's glorious sons and daughters. Shata, Shito, Kapa, Rote, Capre, Honta, Hisha, Hiko, Prata, Hika, Prada, Honta, Herida, Hisha, Tarara, Riko, Prada, Hishka, Tararo, Habare, Hiroda. In Jesus' name. Ah, this morning you will manifest glory. You will manifest testimony. You will manifest glory. You will manifest glory. You will manifest testimony. You will manifest glory. You will manifest testimony. You will manifest glory. You will manifest bless this next three months from April to the end of June. Open doors, open heaven, open doors, open heaven, open doors, open heaven. Every battle that I've risen to stop it, frustrated for your sake. Stopped for your sake, 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 frustrated for your sake. Kayaneta, Malerota, Indareka. Zikaya, Malero, Ombre de Tombra, Shembra, Kebra, Tombre, Eka, Hebro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ba, 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 ba. There is something to your life. It shall manifest. The Bible says in 92 from verse 12, the righteous shall flourish like a palm tree. He shall grow like a cedar in Lebanon. I prophesy unto your life this next three months there shall be a flourishing, 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 flourishing. Ikaya Baba, Ikete Tera, Ambari Rero, Tali Riba, Ema to Kapa, so Brekate, Dom Bredi, Alara Mosha, Ikalerinda, Ibaradata. There shall be a flourishing like a palm tree. There shall be a flourishing. There shall be a flourishing. Those who are planted in the house of the Lord shall flourish in the courts of our God. What does it mean to flourish? It means to be more than prosperous. For every aspect of your life to be making, to be producing. It says shall flourish like a palm tree. How does a palm tree flourish? The palm tree, every part of a palm tree is useful. Even the one that is strange. I saw a strange one recently. I did not even know. <laughs> I saw somewhere, I think in Malaysia or, or so, that when, a palm, when they, they can cut down a palm tree, cut off its bark, and somehow shave, 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 shave. When it remains the inner white, they had a way of, of cutting it until it becomes like grains. And then they wash and wash and wash and wash for the starch in it to come out. I didn't know the tree itself has starch inside. And it became something they use for food. My God. Flourish all round useful every part I speak into your life these next three months every area of your life shall flourish your spiritual life flourish your mental life flourish your family life flourish your business life flourish in the name of Jesus 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 in the name of Jesus, name of Jesus. this morning we declare and decree Alebarota, Irede Baba. I just speak it as I see it. I wouldn't wait for what time I scheduled it to be. I see as if somebody's going to raise a hand of warfare. They came with a strange weapon, but they and their weapons shall perish. They and their weapons shall perish. Whoever attempts your life in this season. Ah, they will fire themselves with their own hand. They will hurt themselves with their own hand. They will hurt themselves with their own hand. Anyone who raises a weapon against you, no weapon formed against you, prosperous. Every mouth that rises against you in judgment shall be condemned. The hand they raise will beat themselves. They 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 will beat themselves. Their weapon will not work on you. Their intent 
tensions will not work on you. Their bitterness will not stop you. Their anger will not stop you. Their arrows will be frustrated by the hand of the Lord. In this new quarter you entered, it shall be a quarter of blessing, quarter of favor, quarter of testimony, quarter of blessing, quarter of favor, quarter of testimony, quarter of blessing. So shall it be. Oh, glory. Oh, glory. Oh, glory. Oh, glory. Oh, glory. You shall manifest purpose exponentially. You will not die in a cheap corner. Ah, everything you touch will prosper. Everything you touch will be blessed. Everything you touch will prosper. Everything you touch will be blessed. Everything you touch will prosper. Everything you touch will be blessed. Everything you touch will prosper. Everything you touch will be blessed. Everything you touch will prosper. Everything you touch will be blessed. Everything you touch will prosper. Everything you touch will be blessed. Ayaya, hirida, hirida, karada, tarere, hirida, kapo, toya, hika, kapa, tata, tata, rika, paro, tapri. Everything you touch will prosper. Everything you touch will be blessed. In the name of Jesus. 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 Everything you touch will prosper. Everything you touch will be blessed. Everything you touch will prosper. Everything you touch will be blessed. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, Malaysia. Nikayeda dorosaya, ida bakayeda daba, ida bororo da 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 da. You will give victory over every battle tool that wants to rise against you we come against them we come against them we declare your victory this morning we declare your testimony this morning in the name of jesus anything wanting to prevent promises from fulfillment we bring them down we bring them down anyone anywhere sitting in, in decision, in deliberations against your name, against your life, against your destiny, against your calling, against your business, against your family, against your children, against your health, against your marriage, against your joy. Ah, their counsel will not stand. Their counsel will not stand. Their counsel fails. 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 In the name of Jesus. As for you, the promises of God will be fulfilled in this season of your life. These next three months. Ah, every morning. You know, my son, my grandson. I, I'm always ready for him. What was your miracle today, granddad? Praise the Lord. It's good for somebody to keep you on your toes so you really trust God for a miracle. Praise the Lord. Uh, Oral Roberts said, expect a miracle every day. Expect a miracle every day. The boy will ask me, what was your miracle today? Praise the Lord. Nayedo shukabida zili. First Kings chapter 8 verse 56, blessed be the Lord who has given rest to his people Israel according to all that he had promised. There has not failed one word of all his good promises, which he promised through his servant Moses. I speak into your life this morning, every promise God made you shall become your reality, shall become your reality, shall become your reality, shall become your reality. Shall become your reality. Da da di di 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 da da di di. Alema tonta ikabaro ishka hibro ubra ida ika aba ono mba ika tala reki bara baro toro bari kedi rabari tiro no raba. It shall become your reality. 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 Pato peke hapa tota hika pato hipa hito hampra hishka taribo toredi tareba torama pariki torama paruzo tariki pradido torona marite torori kariba paruzo taria in Jesus name. Every promise God made to you shall become your reality. Your hand will handle it. Your mouth will testify. Your hand will handle it. Your mouth will testify. April, testimonies. May, testimony. June, testimonies. Not one word failed. 
First Kings 18.56, there has not failed one word of all his good promise, which he promised through his servant Moses. Testimony was being given in First Kings of the word given to Moses. Ah, yeah, 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 between, between, between Moses and First Kings, there's over 500 years, close to a thousand, not one word. Ah, na ya ya ya, he ya ya ya, he karaza, he raba. This season of your life, your hand will be blessed, your eyes will see goodness, your eyes will see goodness, your ears will hear good sound, good news. Proverbs 25, 25, as water is to a thirsty man, so is good news from far country. As water is to a thirsty man. So is good news from far country. You will hear good news. You will hear good news. Good news, promotion. Good news, increase. Good news, favors. Good news, connection with the right persons for your life. Good news, testimonies. Good news, open doors. Good news. Good news, good news, good news. Good relationships, nice people coming into your life. Ay, ay, ay. Make us of destiny. Make us of blessing. Make us of favor. Every blessing I have received in my life, me, I'm the kind who will tell you whatever is happening. Every blessing. Somebody pointed me at that direction. They probably were holding it with two fingers. And I grabbed it. Grab your copy now. I grabbed everything. Where I am right now, leading this morning glow. Somebody told me, follow me. He's the CEO of an, a realty company. Then I see a land by the lagoon. Said, is this one for sale? He said, yes. I love to live by waters. Love, he made my dream happen. Praise God. So I speak into your life today, those kind of men, men like angels, angels like men, men like angels, angels like men will show up in your life. Men like angels, angels like men will show up in your life. Men like angels, angels in like men will show up in your life. Glory to God. Did you hear that? Not one word filled. Joshua also repeated the same thing. Joshua 21 verse 45. Joshua 21 verse 45. Not a word failed of any good thing which the Lord has spoken to the house of Israel. All came to pass. In Africa, we have people who, you know, sometimes they use all kinds of things. The wheelbarrow that is used in, in, in construction sites to, to push sand, sometimes it's used to push goods. Can you believe that's what some family depend on? This guy owns a wheelbarrow and he helps people to carry stuff in the markets and they pay him. That's what feeds his wife, his children. And sometimes children go to school on that little money. But I saw wheelbarrows being pushed and they were bringing in blessings to your house and tipping it and going back to carry more and tipping it. Bringing in the sheep, bringing in the sheep. We shall come rejoicing, bringing in the sheep, bringing in the sheep, bringing in the sheep. We shall come rejoicing, bringing in the sheep. They are bringing in this blessing and tipping it at your doorpost. It's looking shiny like, uh, it, it looks like, looks like okay let me use the best illustration if you enter johannesburg early in the morning and the sun is just beginning to shine you will see places where they had dug for gold before and they have they, they had tipped the sand and it's like a high mountain when you come into into johannesburg early in the morning and the sun is just shining on the place you can see specks specks of shining gold on the whole sand that have been tipped, the people feel they've taken all they can, but you can just still see specks of shining gold on the tipped sand. Somebody this morning, 
angels are coming to tip blessing in your house angels are coming to tip favor into your house angels are bringing the testimony into your house say amen like fire it shall come to pass this next three months let the heavens open let the heavens open let things that died come alive all truths are parallel what you see in the natural realm is a picture of the spiritual realm this month of april may particularly is when the flowers come alive again not only in europe it happens in africa also i was driving through a place the other day as it's coming to the end of march and i saw flowers coming alive again ah things are going to spring up for you in the name of jesus in the name of jesus new life new hope new direction new life new hope new direction things springing up again winter is over life is here winter is over life is here your vision will come alive your dream will come alive your business will come alive in the name of jesus anything that died in your life stop bowing your head and crying as if oh my god no if if God allowed it, better things are coming. So get ready. Favor is coming. Blessing is coming. Testimony is coming. Favor is coming. Blessing is coming. Testimony is coming. Favor is coming. Blessing is coming. Testimony is coming. Favor is coming. Blessing is coming. Testimony is coming. Favor is coming. Blessing is coming. Testimony is coming. Favor is coming. Blessing is coming. Testimony is coming. Kaba kaba kata tata. Hiroshka yadaba tali kaba koso kaya. Hiraba torosa. Hikata raba kaza. Hida raba katali. Habaru tali kaba. Habari kedo raba. Hiraba da hida barari kaza. This month of April to June, I saw a revelation just now. I see some kind of funny animal hibernating for the appropriate time to show its head. Every demonic entity in some kind of hibernation waiting for the time to strike you, we strike them first. We bring the blood of Jesus against every every plan of the enemy, every arrow, every satanic plan, every wolf of the night. The Bible talks of wolves of the night, which talks of which is demonic entities. <laughs> Yesterday I was listening to a comedian, I said that's true. Sometimes you get those kind of crazy dreams. He said, uh, when you are dreaming and the aeroplane is not just landing at the airport, uh, he drove on the street and he came and parked in a corner you know, of a dirty street. And he's, then you know, this is not airport, that's demons messing up with your head. Today, I bring the blood of Jesus against every arrow, every plan, every plan of hell for April, May, June. Ah, against your joy, against your peace, against your family, we cancel by the blood. We cancel by the blood. We cancel by the blood. We cancel by the blood in Jesus' name. Anyone in your household and your extended household that had been marked by the enemy for attack, we cancel that attack. We cancel that attack. We cancel that attack. We cancel that attack in the name of Jesus. 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 Testimony. 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 I am robot. Thank you, Jesus. Oh, glory. 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 Hira baba babo. Hira tala. Hira bara. Victory in the next three months. We know that for the whole year, but we're focusing on this quarter right now. April, May, June, doors opening. April, May, June, favor flowing. April, May, June, testimony upon testimony upon testimony of crazy testimonies. Yeah, you know, shatiki kika parono siki bia. Renom brokata tiki titi tuturi bia. Thank you, Jesus. Victory, victory, victory. Testimonies, victory. Testimonies, victory. Testimonies, victory. Testimonies, victory. Psalm 77 verse 8 nails it when it comes to his promises that have never failed. Psalm 77, it says, has his mercy ceased forever? No. Has his promises failed forevermore? No. The God whom we serve. An old African woman said he is a talk do, the one who talks and does it. She forms a new English word, a talk do. The God who talk do. He talks and 
he does it or talk na do's as a combine of some Eastern Nigerian uh, native word and English word, Jehovah or talk na do. I love it. I'm going to be telling myself all through these three months, if any battle rises, hey, Je my Jehovah is or talk na do. <laughs> Praise God. Has his mercy ceased forever? No. Has his promises failed forevermore? No. He is Jehovah or talk. Now do. God is a promise keeper. May his promises in your life come to pass in the name of Jesus. God is a covenant keeping God. You know, unless you get into the Bible, so now you don't even know the meaning of words. On Sunday, we saw the meaning of tetel es tai. It's illegal spiritual and economic word in bible times when you finish buying a product and you've paid they would slap on the receipt the teller's time finished when you win a battle they'll slap on the receipt the teller's time finished and when uh, a legal case is over they slap on the matter the teller's time finished this morning, the covenant-keeping God will give you victory, will give you testimony. What he says, he will do. 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 His promises are very certain. His promises are very sure. His promises are very certain. His promises are very sure. Tako soyaba, taki jonabe, reno zoluta, riki kotora, zalu jineba, bari ketozo, reto kabere, taru maresha. God is not a man that he should lie, nor the son of man that he should repent as he spoken, will he not do? Numbers 23 verse 19. Has he spoken, and will he not make it good? He is the talk and do, or talk na do. I prophesy into your life this morning. Ah, every promise God gave you, private, public, general, specific, there shall be manifestation. 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 Kabatu, Tarike, Kabata, Tarara, Torora, Tereri, Kabaro, Shanedi, Parari, Torora, Kerera, Tarara, Teroro, Ishkayara Baba. I speak into your life this morning, wherever you are, I want you to say powerful Amen in the name of Jesus. In the light of the four promises of God that can never fail, say Amen to the following. Receive the anointing. That will turn promises to manifestation. 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 Promises. I just saw a revelation. Somebody was given keys to help you and they are reluctant, misbehaving, as, as, acting as if, why should they do it? Then you'll be bigger, then you'll not remember them. And I saw another bigger hand, an angelic hand, take the keys from their hand. Ah! The key of your life. The key of your progress. I was put in somebody's hand to help you and they have failed. We'll take it back. We take it back. We take it back. We take it back. The key of your destiny. Somebody was assigned to bless you. And they became worried that you might be too big. You might be too awesome. You might be too blessed. We take the key. We take the key. We take the key. We take the key. We take the key back. We take the key back. We take the key back. In the name of Jesus. This morning, the anointing that turns hope to reality shall rest on your life. Shall rest on your life. The anointing that turns hope to reality we we release it 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 ayine ki baba alire ri barosh ikabe no lo rosa itali baronte ikabari tesha ibro no so kayite li baru torbari ikabaro skoti li bari talira ba ayerosha 
the anointing that turns promises to testimonies promises to testimonies promises to testimonies promises to testimonies receive 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 in jesus name the anointing that turns prophecies to testimonies they gave you a prophetic word and you've been waiting when lord was some prophecies take long many years ago about 40 years ago dr kenneth copeland said and the day shall come when the greatest voices that will touch the world will come out of africa the whole of america began to mock him and laugh today the greatest voices shaking the world in every ramification of the gospel is beginning to be africa while they are busy arguing about nonsensical things should the church now be getting into same-sex mar marriage africa does not debate that we're not sent to do that the voices arise so god cannot speak a word which will not come to pass though it tarries wait for it so every prophecy given to you in the face of what looks like how can this be receive reality receive reality receive testimonies receive realities receive testimony the prophecy <laughs> Paul wrote to Timothy. He said that prophecy that was given to you when we laid hand on you as a young pastor, use it to do warfare. Today I take the prophecies that were given to you, I use it to do warfare. I declare it shall become testimonies. It shall become testimonies. It shall become testimonies. The prophetic word that were given to you, will be, they become flames. They become sword of flames, cherubs in your hand. They become cherubs in your hand. Sword of flame flaming sword we use it to bring down the enemy and possess possessions in the name of jesus glory to god oh glory to god oh glory to god we chase out the enemy from the garden of our blessing god put cherubs in the garden of eden to chase out adam so this morning we chase out enemies of our blessing with the cherubs of God in our hand, with flaming swords, we chase them out. We chase them out. Anyone sitting on what belongs to you, even if the one in the supremest court of this earth, God will vindicate you. God will fight your fight. Vindicate you. Fight your fight. Vindicate you. Fight your fight. Vindicate you. We send cherubs of heaven to fight such a person. We win your victory in the name of Jesus. Abba I speak this morning that the anointing that turns positive vision to fulfillment rests on you. The anointing that turns positive vision to fulfillment rests on you. The anointing that turns visions to fulfillment, the dreams you have, the visions. That God has shown you where you are going. Turns it to fulfillment. Receive in the name of Jesus. The anointing that turns positive dreams to reality. Receive in the name of Jesus. Receive in the name of Jesus. The anointing that turns positive expectation to reality. The anointing that turns positive expectations. Ah, the Bible says the expectation of the righteous shall not be dashed. The anointing that turns positive expectation to reality. Receive, 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 receive. In the name of Jesus. Long time predictions. Ah! 30 years. 40 years. Word that had been given to you a long time. I prophesy, I declare and decree. It shall become reality. <laughs> First time I went to America and I had to come back to Africa after 12 days. And somebody tried to mock me and laugh at me. Like, hey, he went to America to study. I had to come back to, after 12 days because things didn't go well with his papers. An old man. The late Matthew uh, okay, Otusanya. Never, he can't even preach five minutes. Doesn't like those things. But he heard God. He said, Matthew. He, he was Matthew too. He told me. He said, Matthew. 
see that going to Europe, going anywhere, you even be tired. Wow, is the old man wrong? Correct. I have to do a journey out of Africa into Europe every week nowadays, and I'm so tired, but I'm committed. Uh, God hasn't told me to hand over KRCC UK. So I'm there, will always be there. But see, that word was given. That word was given in 1978. 46 years, man. 46 years ago, the old man gave me that word. So long-term predictions into your life will become the reality of your life. And God has sent people to tell you you will prosper. Doors will open. Don't doubt it. Even if you are eating dry bread with water. Sometimes you eat that by chance. That was my food yesterday. Two slices of bread and ordinary water and some peanuts. Said no, not even juice. Just two slices of bread. You know, one, one, one comedian in Nigeria said, I don't understand these people who are blessed. When they are poor, they are looking for food. When they are rich, they are trying to not eat food. Well, mine is by choice or prophetics. This morning, long time predictions made into your life will become your reality. Godly mandates that I cannot commit to mandates that heaven gave you by an angelic visitation shall become your reality. No devil will stop it, no sin will be able to hinder it, no hand of Satan will be able to stop it in the name of Jesus. Every word given to you, your I will see it, 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 your I will see it. Second Timothy 2.13, he remains faithful. He cannot deny himself. May the faithful God show up in your life this morning. Say amen powerfully wherever you are. God is ever faithful. Even when we are not faithful, I speak into your life. God is faithful. He will do it. 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 In Jesus' name. Psalm 18, number 35. Once I have sworn by my holiness, I will not lie to David. And he will not lie to Matthew. He will not lie. Let me just see. He will not lie to everybody. I'm looking at your name right now. It shall come to pass in the name of Jesus. Michaela Weeks, what God told you will come to pass. Audrey Monroe, what God told you will come to pass. Coca Olumide, what God told you will come to pass. Lady Esther, what God told you will come to pass. Judith Morgan, what God told you will come to pass. Ihoma Okafo, what God told you will come to pass. Doris Makungu, what God told you will come to pass. Shola Peters, what God told you will come to pass. Nii bless what God told you will come to pass. Shalene Samu, what God told you will come to pass. Titilaya Rosemary, what God told you will come to pass. Stella Isaac, what God told you will come to pass. Claudette Amsterdam, Amsterdam in, uh, in uh, Cape Coast, and in uh, Cape Town, <laughs> what God told you will come to pass. And dear Mola Bamindele, what God told you will become reality. Law, law, Obar, what God told you will come to pass. Bridget Imuze. What God told you will come to pass. Gloria or Dita. What God spoke into your life will become your reality. Oshwala. God told you it shall come to pass. Esther Kamara. What God told you will come to pass. Uh, Ronnie. What God told you will come to pass. Uchenna Temuru. What God told you will come to pass. Judith Smith. What God told you will come to pass. Obey Fabi. What God told you will come to pass. Every word that God spoke into all your lives will become your reality in the name of Jesus. I declare, I declare, I declare, I declare on all of you. It shall become your reality. Your eye will see it. Your hand will handle it. Your mouth will testify. Every word that God told you. I speak into all of your life. Isaiah 60 verse 22. A little one of you shall become a thousand. And a small one among us shall become a nation. The Lord will hasten it in his time. It shall become your reality. Obi, it shall become your reality. 
I speak it into your life. William, it shall become your reality. Musuke, it shall become your reality. L-O-D, it shall become your reality. I declare to the Queen Yambi, it shall become your reality. Mary T, it shall become. Winston Burke, it shall become your reality. Lois C, it shall become your reality. Every word, every word, every word, every word. Every word, Sibanda, every word God spoke concerning you, Francis Kosi, every word God gave you shall become the reality of your life. Winifred, it shall become your reality. Your eyes will see it. Edwards, your hand will handle, your mouth will testify, your eye will see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living, in the land of the living, in the land of the living, so shall it be. Your eyes will not see evil. Your eyes will not see good. Only see goodness. So shall it be this morning. We declare it. We decree it. We seal it in the realm of the spirit. We say so shall it be Celestine. You will testify Roland. You will testify OB. You will testify glory to God. Every prophetic word. Some of it is 20, 30 years old. 35. You are even wondering when, when, when. No worries. A thousand years is like one day in the sight of God. Lady Esther, you will testify. I prophesied this morning, Shanda, you will testify. Omoyeni and get ready. Oludari Taiwo, get ready. Rachel, I did you. Get ready for Moraka. Oh, you will tell Pauline Straker. The doors are going to open. Your eyes will see it. Your mouth will testify. Mercy Chioma, get ready. Oh, we give God praise this morning. We magnify him. God is not a man that he should lie, nor the son of man that he should repent. Has he spoken, will he not do it? No good thing will he withhold from you. If God said it, then he will do it. Hey, uh, Yabosha, 1 Timothy 1.18. This charge I commit to you, son Timothy. Remember what I told you earlier. According to the prophecies previously made concerning you, that by them you should wage the good warfare. We use the prophetic word that have been given to you as cherubs, flaming swords, cherubs. We use them to do warfare and silence the enemy on your behalf. Get ready. These three months, blessing beyond your imagination, favor beyond your dream. You're going from glory to glory, from favor to favor, from blessing to blessing, from breakthrough to breakthrough. From turn around to turn around. In Jesus name. In Jesus name. In Jesus name. Amen. 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 Everyone on the platform. Even if I didn't call your name. The prophetic word that was given to you. Shall become your reality. In Jesus name. Amen. 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 Don't let go of that prophetic word. Hold on to it. You will testify. Hold on to it. You will testify. Hold on to it. Same period. As a young pastor, I was getting ready my papers to travel on that journey to the United States in 1978. <clears throat> a prophet of God is passing by a whole crusade in the neighborhood. Heard that I'm a pastor comes into my little one room apartment. I was a bachelor pastor. The church could only rent one room for me. Just one single room, man. Sometimes I have to use what we call a boiling ring to cook my rice and my yam in the same room, man. There were 10 other families sharing the whole house. Jesus, man, poverty is not good. Oh. And this guy walks into my house in fellowship. As he prayed briefly, he said, man of God, I see that one day you will live in a strange land. So when, after that prophetic word, I had to come back after 12 days, I called him a false prophet. God forgive me. Only to find that a couple of years later, I was called by my denomination to be a pastor in London, England. Every prophetic word that has ever been given to you, even when your head doubted it, it shall become the reality of your life. In Jesus' name. Amen. 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 
We close this morning with a couple of announcements. Uh, very major, very major. Let me start straight away for a long time also again. We've always taught people, taught people, taught people that they can only prosper by running their own business. But did you know that we can, you can, with the career you run, you can prosper, you can become a millionaire through career. Because some of you say, but I'm not cut out to run a business. I'm cut out to be a doctor. I'm cut out to be a pharmacist. I'm cut out to be one, two, in the wealth master class teach you <coughs> how to prosper through your career. Yeah, God didn't give you that career to fill wealth creation for the nine to five career person. Hey, it's going to be hard, 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 feeling hard, hard, hard. Changing narratives, creating new paradigms. Wealth creation for the nine to five career person. You are a nurse, we'll teach you how to turn it into multi-million. You are a doctor, you are a pharmacist, you are a teacher. You say, what, what with my little income? Come, let us teach you what to do. The difference oftentimes is in the information you get. Wealth creation for the nine to five career person. Changing narratives, creating new paradigms. It will blow your socks off. It will turn your life around. I'm sure you were blessed this morning by this morning's morning glow. Make sure you join us tomorrow morning. And tomorrow evening we have Bible study. It's going to be absolutely great. It's going to be absolutely powerful. This year is the year of more than enough. God is going to give you more than enough. More, 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 more than enough. You will be blessed with more than enough. Let me encourage you also to please don't say silent. Tell, Jesus, tell people that Jesus has finished the work of salvation for them. And be a witness. Pull them to Christ. Draw them to the Lord. Draw them to the Lord. <laughs> we said 100 days. And it's going to end in two days time. From the first week of January to every four. We're going to set another one. Ten friends every 100 days. Ten friends. You must not go and empty and that those are save your meat. You must show up with something. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Uh, one more announcement I wanted to make. I think they need to scroll for me to even see it. It's gone from my head right now. Uh, okay, yes, 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 yes. The time has changed and many of you, I'm grateful. I'm glad you made it. You got the time right. May you be blessed all the time. Please tell the other people our times have adjusted by one hour. Well, Morning Glue comes from the United Kingdom. And therefore, we have to follow the time of the United Kingdom. So kindly adjust with us. I know you will always be blessed. Your sacrifice will never be in vain. Praise the Lord. Uh, I was so blessed this morning. I'm telling you, I'm really, 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 really blessed. Whole of yesterday, uh, man, have I ever really felt so sleepy in the morning and afternoon times having landed Oh, I slept and slept and just sat and sat and prayed and prayed and just kept drinking water and my two slices of bread and peanuts. It was enjoyable. Enjoyable. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. May the Lord bless you, keep you, make his face shine on you, give you peace, bless your going out, bless your coming in. Everything you touch will be blessed. You will not fail. You will succeed. The oil of God is on your life. These next three months. Ah! This quarter will be a quarter of favor. Showers of blessing. They are unique months. Four is the number of balance. Five is the number of grace. And six is the number of man. Four, balanced blessings. Balanced favor. Five, mercy grace. Five is the number of grace. May grace be unto you. The Bible says the man by the pool of Beth Esther was in a place of five porches. Five, grace will be available to you. Six is the number of man. You are that man, you are that woman that God will bless. Favor will be on your household. Today, winds of favor will blow towards you. The sun of greatness will shine on you. And if you are in a winter's place, even the breeze of cold will chill out your enemies. And strengthen your life. You will have testimony. So shall it be. In Jesus name. God bless you richly.
Dio Steven Diga, Dio Steven Soy, Wana Kubariki, Unyami Shra, Yabarikesh, Yabarike, Wariba Kukumbrere, Wamuzita Rayesu, Nkulunkulu, Agubu says, Good morning, Saobona, thank you very much, Yabonga Kakulu, God bless.